with the amount of Are We There Yet's closing in on double digits, the Grand Canyon National Park just 30 minutes away. Where Ethan gets carsick, Kyle produces natural Dramamine, face down in his Nintendo Switch, and only looking up occasionally when answering if he has to go to the bathroom or not. Their home in Orange, California, now a day's worth of travel away, it wasn't four hours into the car ride, wait, wait, don't tell me, becoming white noise, the mother Tracy and father Ron, starting to wonder, whose idea was it to go to the Grand Canyon? Their camelbacks sweating in the cup holder, it was mid-June, the kids just got out of school, and this being their first attempt at relaxation. An eight-hour car ride with Mario Kart sound effects in the background. Did they want to go, or did they feel like they had to go? Ron, at an REI, buying a bucket hat with a do-rag-like tail coming down the back to prevent sunburn on the neck, then using every excuse he could to wear it because, according to Tracy, that's not something you wear to Chili's. Did they finally pay off the 08 Honda Odyssey and realize that the farthest they've taken it was the hour and a half sprint down to SeaWorld, its interior christened by crushed cheese, its red Gatorade, and the hair of their golden retriever, Benny. Did they realize that they each owned an Oshkosh t-shirt, cargo shorts, and fake Oakley sunglasses that you get at Rite Aid, a sense of urgency then setting in, thinking that if they don't go to a national park soon, they'll be limited to life as good t-shirts and dockers. Siri chimes in. You've arrived. And now beginning the 10-minute loop of, oh my gosh, jeez, this is incredible. It's a lot bigger than I thought. Soon they're going to have to approach another tourist, and a tourist that probably came into Toyota Siena, and ask that if they will take a photo of them. They stack in two rows, the parents taken up the back, each with their outer arm getting familiar with Ethan and Kyle's shoulders. The tourist taking the photo has an iPhone. So trying to take a photo on Ron's Samsung Galaxy, a bit confusing. And not to mention it's mid-June at 4.30 p.m., the glare not making anything easier. Ron has to break position, meet the photographer halfway, and as he draws his password in, opens up the camera, and then gets back into place. Ethan just now getting over his car sickness, a little out of it. He hasn't put his smile down. He's been holding cheese during this whole ordeal. The result? The photo above their fireplace back home showing Tracy, Ron, and Kyle happy in one of the most magnificent national parks in the country. But Ethan, looking like he soiled himself. Hello, everyone. My name is John Russo, host of the Here's My Thing podcast, and I have always wanted to do that where you point and then the image is right here. Um, thank you for listening, watching the video. I very much appreciate it. And, and I, I look forward to talking again next time.